All right, Coach, talk about uh, what summer practice has been looking like going into the fall. Uh, summer practice has been really, really good. Uh, our attendance has been really well. Uh, when I got here in April, we had 48 kids off season, so our, our roster right now, we're at 71. Uh, so that's really good. Um, they showed up. We got we got a, a tremendously better over the summer. We, we come farther offensively and defensively than I thought we would be right now. So looking forward to the season. Uh, so let's talk about your offense. How's the offense looking? Um, who are some of the key guys that you're looking to take, uh, off, take off, a stand? Offense is really balanced. Um, you got Andrew Jenkins coming back to quarterback. Uh, he stepped in when uh, quarterback last year, Keelan Mills, got hurt. So he's, a, he's been in the fire. He's a really smart kid, 34 ACT, 4.2 GPA. So he does all the right things with the football. Um, we got a stable of running backs, as West Memphis always has. So we can play three or four running backs and get the job accomplished, just trying to get our offense lined up to speed. Uh, we have wide receivers, too deep at every, uh, at every position. And I feel like we got some guys that can run, and they fit the offense really well that I'm bringing in. So, you know, look, really looking forward to how we progress as the season goes on. Let's talk about your defense, how they look, and who are some of the key guys you're looking at on defense? Okay. Defensively, uh, we're a three-stack defense. Uh, we got a lot of hybrid kids on the de defensive line and linebacker, and I think that fits our – you know, the personnel that West Memphis is going to typically have. You're going to have kids that strong, can run, kind of tweeners. Um, uh, Mike Linebacker, take on dancing returns. Uh, really excited about him. Martarius Hayes returns to safety. Excited about what he brings to the table as well. And our defense line, it's going to be hard for people to block them on a week-to-week -week basis. Uh, it just, it's hard for us to block them. Uh, just in what we do, and we slant, and we move, and we shift, and they can run. Those guys are strong. Coach Altman, our defense line coach, does a really good job with them. So um, really excited about, you know, the direction of where we're going and, you know, the scheme and how it fits our kids. You guys got a benefit game coming up soon? Yes. Uh, talk about what you guys want to get accomplished before the benefit game. Okay. Um, we play Lava uh, on Tuesday, August the 20th. Um, we um, have a practice on Monday to kind of get ready for that. to be a mock practice, walk through, kind of clean some stuff up. Uh, we're going to go up there and we're going to play our, our starters the first half and we're going to try to see some of our JV guys, some 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 guys on the second string and third string and, and see where they look and assess the film and see where the depth chart falls for our first game. Uh, talk about what you guys want to get accomplished before the first game too. Okay. Uh, before we play our first game, man, just it's a it's a day by day process. Um, you know, you go through the summer and you go through the, the fall camp and you do your installs and you know, we've gotten through our install at this point, which is a really good thing. So right now, we just find a fine tuning uh, the things that we put in and little small details that they might be messing up on. Just trying to coach them up on it. That's kind of what our practice was today. Had a little walkthrough and um, just kind of service offense and defense. And we're just trying to get some things cleaned up so we can execute our offense and defense.